So Tom, you started writing articles. I did. How does that feel? Well, you took me completely out of my comfort zone. I've never, never considered myself uh, a writer or a party in anything. And, uh, but I got all this knowledge in my head. And I have like, you know, 25, 30 years of, of, of knowledge. I've been in the technology field since the 80s. Wow. So, That's and I've seen it. I've seen the change. Like, the, yeah, I've seen the, 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 the transition from, you know, we were using pagers way back when we went to, you know, bag phones and we went, <laughs> then we went to these things. Uh, you know, we have more power in this than we had in, in any computer back in the 80s. So and all this, all this, all this that you've seen, you, you, you've been compelled lately to say, you know what, I'm going to put my knowledge out there so people can learn from the things that I've seen. Exactly. So, uh, you know, I just posted an article uh, on uh, LinkedIn and Facebook and Twitter about smart homes and why you might want to consider having a smart home. Why would someone want that? Well, the safety, uh, better resale value. I mean, really, that's uh, convenience. Mm. Uh, you know, just think of your thermostat. You know, if you're in bed, usually people have their thermostat downstairs uh, in the main hallway or a main floor. You know, and mine's upstairs, and my bedroom's upstairs. So if I want to change the thermostat, I got to get, and if you're like me, you know, you get out of bed, you walk down a flight of steps into complete dark, you know, you step on something like a shoe that was left, you know, you fall on your face. Yeah. So, you know, you know, you know, why put the light on, really? Uh, where's wait, wait, where's the challenge in that? Light culture matters. <laughs> so writing has helped you convey these thoughts to add value to people. Yes. yes should so. people start writing their thoughts down? I think everybody should write their thoughts down. And I've always kept a diary. It's not so much a diary like your diary, but more, you know, what I've accomplished in that day and what needs to be accomplished the next day or something like that. I have yeah. a stack of books like this, wow. like copy books. And I just, I just, but now you're like that. out there. But now I take them and I turn them into stories. And I turn them into articles, and I turn them into content, and I turn them into stuff that perhaps somebody can learn from my experience. Uh, somebody can learn from my mistakes, perhaps. You know, I've made a lot of mistakes in my life, and, you know, you learn from them. And, uh, you know, and if I'm able to write them down in an in organized fashion, yeah. then hopefully somebody won't have to make that same mistake.